Just Kate's locker has a... Yep, okay. That's interesting. Alright, let's do this. Gonna make ourselves a little soda bomb. Here, drink this soda. Like, a lot of it. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! Chloe's Can insane. You light the candle? <laughs> this is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. That was so fucking cool! Now don't give Chloe oh, the ingredients. Toast. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, Gotta so run. What should we do? Gotta get evidence. Let's go. We're getting in there. That's the bathrooms. We gotta get in here. Looking around, looking around, looking around, looking around. What is there? Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Something was flashing. No! Is there really nothing? There's only one way around this. All right, I'm missing something. Oh. Oh! Hey, Kate. I'm on the other side of the door, yo. Don't worry. All right, let's look for... Nothing's popping up. What's going on? Can't use the computer. There's nothing here, guys. Maybe I have to let her in. If I can get this bastard okay. open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. <laughs> this is gonna be funny. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. Huh? I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. <laughs> now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Let's brew up in a bottle. Man, I can see where the principal locks Without telling the other teacher in classes around him. Oh. I just want everybody to know he has money. That but sucks. No How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Easy. Zing zing! I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. Get your foot off the desk, man. This He's gonna see the dirt. To truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock? Find us some clues about Rachel or Kate or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Let's have some light. Kate's files. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Represents the very best of students at the Blackwell Academy. Her GPA is consistently outstanding along with her optimistic attitude and quiet work ethic. Her extracurricular activities with Meals on Wheels program has been acknowledged. At KBA 7 News and her diverse religious studies group has been a welcome addition to the wide range of student-led spiritual programs at Blackwell. She also has one of the best attendance records in the school's history. At present time, there's a security investigation into the controversial video allegedly featuring Kate Marsh at a Vortex Club party that has been uploaded onto the internet without her knowledge on alleged consent or alleged consent along with her claim of being taken to the hospital during the party. The attached files for complete details. As a school nurse, I should inform you that Kate Marsh appears to have experienced some recent emotional or physical trauma. I spoke to her briefly and she was upset but vague and refused to talk further with me. I think it's important that we keep our eyes on her and make sure she's not under duress from other classmates, as is my suspicion. You were warned, you piece of garbage. You were warned. Only 
two more files to go. All right, we gotta read the message. Oh, please, I just want to know if you knew your explosives. Wait a minute. So did you blow the lock? <laughs> and to see your incredible artwork. And we're gonna have to read this in a minute. Remind me. I certainly can't use this. Why not? It's so dark in here again. It was so light in here earlier. Looks like an oil painting spill. Awful. Look at this pile. Tumbleweeds. So Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. Shocker. In light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel my large contributions to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. Of course, this situation can be rectified once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that the tragic events involving Miss Marsh give you pause, but I would suggest that canceling Thursday's party is not conduct conducive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell's ac Academy. I expect you to re reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Jerk. My son can do no wrong. That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Okay, I want to know this. As Principal of Blackwell Academy, it's my glad, happy, fortunate duty to inform you that your petition to black block the installation of a new surveillance system has received enough signatures for the school to reject the plan. It is not my policy take sides in these matters as we encourage faculty and student body to participate in their school's operation. However, I did recognize the controversial nature of these cameras and shared your concern for possible invasions of privacy. Thank you for your passion and the inspiring Blackwell students to make their voices heard. I hope they will feel empowered by the outcome of your petition. Look at the bird. You're not so tacky up close. Take a picture. Nope. Perch. Wowzer, this will so not come in handy. Whiskey. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. And nothing here. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Student information. Unfortunately, Rachel Amber has stopped attending class for the past month and she's left no contact with students or faculty for the past month. Her parents are at the present unaware of her whereabouts and Blackwell hopes for their quick return to continue her academic excellence. Rachel Amber is a quintessential student representation of Blackwell Academy. She excels in all of her studies and extracurricular activities, which are numerous. Popular with both students and faculty, she has the de facto qualities of scholarship and leadership that is a hallmark of Blackwell's, Blackwell's legacy. Her diverse, diverse goals include a career in their international law and fashion modeling. There's no doubt that Rachel will achieve all her dreams with Blackwell as fulcrum. This is Lieutenant Chris Rosie. Just wanted to let you know that Rachel's Amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end. We always hope for that one magic clue, but once again, I can't... I can't Arcadia Bay covers up another secret. We always keep our eyes up and ears open, but that's all we can do from now. Thanks for all your help. Okay. So they closed the investigation. Damn, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad, Bad Chloe. Chloe. What'd you do, Chloe? Chloe Price is a problematic student at Blackwell despite the best efforts of the faculty and administration to guide her academically. Chloe does little homework and is often willfully belligerent to her teacher. She has caused numerous class disruptions with inappropriate comments and rude gestures to fellow students. She has recently suspended for spray painting graffiti in the parking lot. Even though Chloe is an in intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander it on empty rebellion against a non-mandatory institution. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Of course he does. Ethan Prescott continues his family's historical legacy at Blackwell Academy with a stellar academic record and the variety of extracurricular activities, including work with the Academy Bay Homeless Fund. Ethan also is popular with students and faculty. He stands as a proud reputation of Blackwell. Oops. No. I think 
Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. Dang it. I didn't mean to miss whatever she was going to say about him. Brief summary, Max, as she prefers to be called, is considered a quiet, attentive student with much potential for her photography. Her GPA fluctuates and she has it acknowledged she should be doing better. Her teachers back up her qu quiet intelligence, so some complaints find her too nervous and nosy. <laughs> some faculty members would like Max to speak up more in class and be more assertive. Others would like her to be less so. This is a common student suggestion rather than a specific recommendation. Update. Despite some recent confrontations with Blackwell security, Max showed herself to represent the very best of Blackwell Academy by stopping fellow student Kate Marsh from jumping off the dormitory roof today. At this time, there is an ongoing police faculty investigation, but Max's heroism is undisputed. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. I'll projectile vomit. Brief summary, Victoria Chase is the gold standard for Blackwell Academy, a student with a consistently high GPA and extracurricular activities that reflect her career goals in photography. Victoria also receives high marks from faculty for a devotion to the Vortex Club, among, among other organizations devoted to Blackwell's better history. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Warren is considered an... <clears throat> Excuse me, is considered an, an exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science at Blackwell. He has a gift of or curse of gab, depending on the faculty. Some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by the science teacher, Miss Grant. We hope Warren focuses his academic vision and continues work towards his bright future. Cool. Learned things. So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. Yeah. Shocker. Okay, we missed one. Unless you are finding Max, something. You better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescott's dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Yep. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy and drawing. print all. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's... Fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. Don't shit no, on his chair. We're not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. Mm -hmm. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. Yeah. Except chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Mm-mm, You can't have it. Are you going to make a big issue out of this? Yes. Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Every decision with Chloe, man. You gotta leave it, because then people will know we're here. Chloe, use you your head. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office morgue. Okay, maybe that wasn't money to them. I could have probably said I take know it. That money would have helped Chloe and me. Mm. 
I thought that was money going directly to the principal marked handicapped fund. Regardless, sticking to it. I'm not going to rewind that decision. That's one thing I've noticed playing this game. I don't do that a lot English of the. Look scares me. I choose Care a lot for of. For a midnight swim, the Blackwell nice. pool is ours. Swimming. You want to take that risk? I'm playing now? this like a, a real it's life a scenario where I try to make a decision and stay with it. To pay off Frank, and so this is a couple where it's like you can get another option here. Then, then that's different. Fun for a few minutes. Splish splash. You're right. We hella deserve taking a bath. Splish splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. I'm a good black bad influence. That's funny. Yuri, what up, dude? Hello. Hey, the bot is alive because the sound effect goes off. Welcome to the stream, oh man. How are you doing? You missed a bomb, my man. Holy crap, this game got really heavy. But welcome to the stream. Thanks for dropping in. Appreciate you being here. How you doing? We're in the otter's you want? lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? Oh, you're good, man. I still go to school here. You Phone can call own away. this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Trophies. Go otters. Okay, what do you want to do here, Chloe? And get us in trouble, I swear. There's a- ooh, new stuff. I hope the otters will survive. There's an ad. I actually don't have the time to investigate this caper. Some monster goggles, okay. If only I could solve the mystery of the missing cat pics. Wow. That's so sad. That person's stuff or backpack is all over the place. Alright, Chloe. Boys or girls? I kind of want to go to the boys' locker room and uh, see if Nathan's got anything. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Nope. Music is ominous. Back it. I guess that somebody looks like forgot Nathan's. their Blackwell spirit. Guess not. I don't know, Logan. I guess I should consider this evolution. I didn't, I didn't know that I may hold, but I still care about you. Okay. Wow. Boys Way to go, guys. Right. No worries. It's all bad. Sometimes. We're going to find Nathan's locker. This must be for training kids. No way am I touching Zach's jersey. Cell phone. Zach is really careless. Doesn't Who he know what happens when I'm around? Who left our phone here? Hey. Thinking bad things about you. Cool. What are you wearing? Just my crystal necklace and phone. Odd. What are you wearing? Hey! Hikaro, thank you for the raid, man! Please tell me I pronounced your name wrong. Or right. Oh, jeez. Uh, welcome to the stream. Thank you for dropping in. Thank you for that raid. Welcome, welcome. Uh, just playing a little bit of uh, wrong as fuck. Let me look at it. Oh, wow. You're totally right. On this screen, it looks way different. All right, LK zero. That more right? <laughs> Sorry, man. I did not mean to pronounce it right. It looks like a L I K over here on this little screen. How's the game going? Um, good. We just had a bombshell drop on us about an hour ago. Um, have you played this game before? If not, I don't want to do any spoilers. Um, if you're interested in the game, so uh, if you have played it, I will fill you in. If not, I'm gonna... Yeah, you played it? Okay, uh, so we saved Kate. Um, that was, uh, that was heavy. But we managed to save her, which was good. 
And uh, now we're in the boys' lo locker room trying to dig up dirt on uh, Nathan. That's my hope, anyway. Only wearing jerseys sitting in on my football. Yeah. All right, well, now we have proof that he's cheating on his girlfriend. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class.